so guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel, and today we're going to be doing a spinnerbait unboxing and spinnerbait reviews, and we also got three other spinnerbaits we're going to be showing you today, so let's get right into it. First one of the day. Is the pond spinnerbait? It's neon. But yeah, this is it. And it is pretty big, but not as big as the ones in which. This one doesn't have any string. And it's silver. The head is. And probably won't work. Oh, this is mine. There you go, we got it. But yeah, this is probably one of the biggest ones. I had one that was like twice its size, but I left it in my uncle's boat. I only went fishing. But yeah, here's the one that we're going to be unboxing. By striking. Yes. This actually might be my first one by striking. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to move these spinner baits to the side of it. Just look at this thing, though, the colorations. We're about to unbox it right here. Right now. Oh, I can't wait to get my hands on this. Mm, I don't want to mess with it. It's so gorgeous. Striking has the best spinner baits. Oh my gosh. So it has short skirts right here. Then it has a longer skirt down there. Yeah, this is probably my new favorite. <laughs> Look at that. I love this spinnerbait. It has the black hook. My gosh, that is a giant hook. Look at that. I might use this at my, you know, any place really that has bass in it. My gosh, dang. Look at that thing. Has black and green camouflage, white, every color that you would need in just one lure for bass and ponds. Hey, look, so remember this one was big? Look at the size comparison. Hey, look at that. These are them side by side. This one is a giant. My gosh, you will be able to get like a 20 pounder on this thing. My gosh, look how big that thing is. My gosh, this thing has like everything that you need. Gold blade, silver blade. 
Seems like blades on there. Look at those eyes, though. They're, like, sticking out. That tells you it's a good lure. This was, like, $6 at Walmart, too. Worth it for the price. It looked small in the package. I didn't know that this was going to be here. What a surprise. Like, this is probably going to be one of my new favorite lures. Like, look at the size comparison. This is a topwater popper compared to it. Facing up. Seems like size and length, counting the feathers. Oh my gosh. I'm going to be really gentle with this one. But yeah, this is the top water popper I, I showed you. My favorite lure of all time. Top water poppers. Just hands down the best. Gentleman sucks. But this spinnerbait? And I don't n normally fish with spinnerbaits. I had to get it for a week, but... My gosh, like, what? Like... Walmart, wait, like, Walmart. My gosh. This is probably better than Bass Pro. I mean, no, Bass Pro is good, but, like, it has everything they want. My gosh, Walmart has, like, a lot of lures, but this one is definitely worth the color. And the money, probably. Most likely. You could get, like, this is probably made for lakes. Like, look, guys, even it, it's, the skirts open up. So you can see the hook. That is a monster hook. My gosh. What is up with striking? Striking is probably my new favorite spinner they have my new favorite spinner baits now striking get spinner baits from striking if you like spinner baits striking will get you what you want hey gosh you can even see it striking you should get a lure from there a spinner bait and my dad did get a spinner bait from there, and it was sick. They have every spinner bait that you would probably like. Yeah, get your spinner baits from striking. No. Like, look, this is from Walmart. Looks cool, right? Red hook. But the only thing I don't really like about it is that the red is actually paint. And it comes off. And this one has styrofoam. I mean, um, I think cardboard. Or, I don't know what material it's made out of. But it is definitely a cool lure. And I, I don't know if this one was made by striking or not. I did lose a lure like it at my uncle's pond. And... My dad had the same exact like one. But look at the size comparison. Skirts. What is it? My gosh, this thing is a giant. A bass would have to have a big mouth for this thing. My gosh, I'm going to have to put this in a special place. Why am I going to pivot? My little tackle box is like full. Like I can't really find a place for it. This is probably my new favorite. I mean, this is my favorite spinner bit. I did get one that was probably bigger than it. Maybe. I don't remember if it was by striking or something else. But it was a ginormous spinner bait I had. And I lost it in my uncle's boat. Then. My dad let me choose out the spinnerbait, and I chose out this thing. <laughs> that thing is huge. 
Thank you, Strike King. Gosh. Strike King. You have to sponsor this video, please. I'm begging you. My gosh. Hey, look at this thing compared to my hand. Hand. Skirt and everything. That is huge. This is it. To one of these sharpeners. It's over the top. Look at that. It's over the top of the eraser. Oh, I'm going to do it to um, an average water bottle that you drink out of every day. That's it. Gosh, like look at that. That is a monster. You don't need to catch like a big bass to get something on that. I'm gonna, I found a special place, I think. You see this? It gets its own place. Oh, sorry. My bad. Look at this. Look at this. So this is my tackle box. See this open spot? It's gonna get it to itself. Look, look, this is it compared to my head. Okay, we're gonna put that in a spot here. That thing's beautiful. I hope you had, I mean, I hope you have the awesome rest of your day. And I hope you enjoyed this video. Hit that subscribe button and share it to everybody that you know and like it. I can subscribe. Peace out, y'all.